Hey, good day to you. This is Todd. I am a regular dude walking in the Word. Um, we're concluding Genesis chapter 25 today, and it's entitled, He Despised. Okay? And this is taken from Genesis 25, verses 27 to 34. And then later, we're going to also be looking at Hebrews 12, verses 16 through 17. Okay? So if you have your Bibles, let's first turn to Hebrews 25, uh, verses 27 to 34. All right, it says this. The boys grew up, and Esau became a skillful hunter, a man of open country, while Jacob was content to stay at home among the tents. Okay? Each, each child is different. Uh, not, not a huge deal here. All right? Isaac, who had a taste for wild game, loved Esau, but Rebekah loved Jacob. Once when Jacob was cooking some stew, Esau came in from the open country famished. He said to Jacob, Quick! Let me have some of that red stew. I'm famished. That is why he was call, also called Edom. Jacob replied, First sell me your birthright. Look, I'm about to die, Esau said. What good is the birthright to me? But Jacob said, Swear to me first. So he swore an oath to him, selling his birthright to Jacob. Then Jacob gave Esau some bread and some lentil stew. He ate and drank and then got up and left. So Esau despised his birthright. Let me read that last sentence again. So Esau despised his birthright. The tragedy is this. <clears throat> he takes something that is like inherited to him, um, his birthright, which is, is a sacred thing. Um, and it's it's so important. And he, he despises that and thinks so lowly of it that he's willing to trade a meal for it. Okay. Um, you might be hungry and you might like, there's been times where, um, I've been on a bike ride and, and I'm like, I run out of water. And so when I get to a store, I buy not only water, I buy Gatorade, maybe a soda just to, uh, you know, replenish everything. And then I get some food too, all that stuff, you know, um, but I'm not, I'm not like selling my soul, uh, for it either you know and despising you know giving up my salvation uh for that um but that's what uh esau is guilty of here he's he's guilty of that he thinks so lowly of it and i want us to turn now to hebrews um where it talks about he talks about it in you gotta when you're studying the bible you gotta look at where else does it talk about it and it talks about it here in hebrews okay one of the last books of the Bible. Okay, so Hebrews 12, verses 16 through 17 says this. See that no one is sexually immoral or is godless like Esau. Ah, what? I mean, here, the writer of Hebrews is saying Esau is godless. So let's see what, let's continue on. Who for a single meal sold his inheritance rights as the oldest son. Okay, it, it, it doesn't even compare. You're selling your whole inheritance rights for a meal like it doesn't even make sense why would he do that but that's what he does um, because he he just despised he didn't care about it all right uh, he sold single for a single meal sold his inheritance right as his oldest son verse 17 afterward as you know when he wanted to be inherit this blessing he was rejected even though he sought the blessing with tears he could not change what he had done. Now I want you to see here this too. It, it points out here that he he was in tears. Okay, he was in tears. He was crying because he lost his birthright and and the blessings. Um, but he wasn't repentant. He wasn't like, man, I'm sorry, I I did that. Um, you know, and repentant about what he did. He was just shedding tears because he lost his the birthright and and the blessing also. Okay. So there's a difference between repenting, which is what we need to do, and being sorry that you lost it, okay? Uh, lost. So uh, hopefully that makes sense. But Esau treated uh, what God had, you know, really given to him, that, that blessing, that inheritance. He treated it so lowly and, and traded it for a meal, Okay. Um, you know, I'll, I'll be in at uh, McDonald's or whatever, and I'll pay, you know, the six bucks or whatever for the meal. Um, but I, I, am I going to trade, you know, my truck for the meal? No, that, that doesn't even uh, compare to it, okay? 
or you know my house for the meal no but that's exactly what um, Esau was doing he was trading his whole inheritance for the meal just because he despised it you know if I go man that truck is a piece of junk anyway sure you take my truck for this meal you know no that that's not the way it should be so that he was despising what God had given him okay and that's the tragedy of this whole thing um, when you look at it you when you first read through it you're like oh, what's the big deal here you know he, he, he was hungry but no he was despising what God gave him okay and that was the tragedy of the whole thing all right so that concludes chapter 25 I thank you for watching and we'll jump into chapter 26 tomorrow um, I'm just a regular dude walking in the word and I look forward to seeing you tomorrow Lord's blessing see you then